Well, it's been a couple months. Uh, um, I cooked another axle. This is the, uh, the aftermath, uh, completely broke it off, actually. Uh, you guys can see. Yeah, it's... And then the inner insides of this are completely shaved, unfortunately. So, that was a super, <coughs> super easy replacement. So, we just replaced the axle. Also, I got new wheels. Um, work VSXX. Um, three inch lips, two inch lips. Or, yeah, that's it? Two and a half, two and a half inch lips. Um, yeah, I, um... I went lower, obviously, because how would I break my axle if I went, didn't go lower? Um, that's really it. Uh, exhaust. What are you talking about? Exhaust. What about it? You got an exhaust. Oh, I got an exhaust. I had an exhaust for three months. Never put it on because I didn't know how. And we put it on. It was literally on the floor, so we had to make a custom bracket to tuck it up. But, yeah, that's all done. So I'm going to go ahead to AutoZone to get the lifetime warranty for this axle. Get my money back because I'm not paying for this again. So it's probably going to happen again because I'm about to go lower today in the front. But I got to roll my fenders and take my plastics out. But, yeah. Guys, ignore, like, my outfit, everything, bro, my hair. I just got off work. You guys can already hear. You guys can already hear. Put the new exhaust in that I've had for months. That I was trying to avoid because I had to I had to cut it. It doesn't, it hangs pretty low. So we're going to low to so try and get a bar to push it up higher. But as you guys can hear, it's not going too hard. It's scraping on flag down. So, you know, it happens. Oh my. It's kind of annoying. I mean, I guess it's not really a new exhaust anymore. But, it actually is making me mad. But, the 40k, oh, you guys don't even know this. I got 40ks. Pulled up to BC Racing. Got 40ks. They're riding nice. You know? So, that help. That helps. I guess. I mean, right now it's not helping, but. Obviously, you've been here. My, my exhaust is probably gone by now, but. We made it. We're at Lowe's. We're gonna get the bar. And we still have to drive back, but we had no tools, no jack. We only have a spare. No tools at all. And we're not towing this junk home, so whatever. It happens. Thanks for watching this little clip. Hopefully we don't get pulled over for throwing mad sparks. No joke, I'm scraping so bad, it smells like fireworks. Great. Um. Why, why I was away, I guess. I don't know, bro. I really haven't even been gone that long. I got 40K, so springs. Give my 20s and 24s to my brother who has a Honda Civic Si, and he just got um, uh, new work wheels, so he had uh, get stiffer springs if he wanted to go lower. So I gave him those. I'm on 40s now, and um, another thing that happened was today actually. Uh, <laughs> this is so dumb thinking about it. Or like, he's gonna pop the clip up. Like right now. And so basically, I, as you guys can see in the video, like he'll zoom in. I couldn't see the speed bump because of the shadow. And I flew over it going 15 miles an hour straight on. He's like, gung, 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 gung. It was so bad. Like it, the video does not do it justice, bro. It sounded like someone got in a car crash. I still haven't even gotten to assess the damage. So I'm driving on it, like not knowing if it's damaged or not. There's like a noise in the back. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I don't know. My wheels are somehow okay. 
They didn't get cracked. I, don't, I literally do not know how. But thank goodness that nothing in my car is like majorly broken because it still drives. But that was what happened today. Just to catch you guys up. Was looking under my car. And uh, th this is my trans case. It's not very, not looking too good. If you look from that angle. Ooh, scraped a lot. A lot, a lot. Um, My frame. It's a little dented. It's my exhaust. It goes all the way back there. Um, uh, we also realized with my alignment that both sides are cooked. Which is why we're doing my tight right ends. I don't know if you can see up here. That's how cooked they are. Like, oh my goodness. But my axe was looking absolutely phenomenal. And, um... Coming soon, um, in the next couple of days, we're going to be actually slotting the front because I'm getting an alignment because I found an alignment shop. Um, going to be adding washers to the back. Got a little bit of an oil leak there. Um, but other than that, you know, I'm going to be raising my engine as well. So, yeah, we have a lot of plans.